Europe League attacks represent uh, an advanced class of uh, exploits wherein the uh, threat actors doesn't need any um, doesn't need any interaction from the user which means uh, unlike traditional attacks that requires uh, users interactions such as uh, clicking on a malicious link or opening an affected file. So this is this uh, thing make it really dangerous for the victims because they will not be aware about the existence of this attack on their devices until it's too late. Also, it's worth mentioning that these attacks can evade the uh, security mechanisms that we implement on the phone or use on the phone or any device such as the antivirus programs or any mail filtering because we use these uh, techniques to prevent and detect such attacks, but for the zero-click attacks, it doesn't help. It's uh, worth mentioning that whenever a successful zero-click at uh, zero attack happens, the uh, threat actor gain a persistent access to this device, even if the vulnerabilities were patched later on because once they get this access to the device or get all control over this device, which means they will have uh, continuous monitoring of this device, the user's activities, until they find the information that they need. For example, they can continually uh, steal information or data. Um, they can continually uh, install some malwares on the device, which make it really dangerous for the users. In order to safeguard yourself from zero-click attacks, um, you should use um, multi-layer defense mechanisms, which means combining the technical security uh, functionalities on the device itself and it's also it requires the user's awareness which will include um, updating the mobile or the devices regularly to the latest uh, versions that the manufacturers uh, provide. Also it will require them to use uh, the uh, uh, allow or give the permissions uh, uh, for the apps that they need only not uh, allowing them to have all the access to everything. You just need to select limited photos. You will not uh, give them the full access or the full permission. Uh, they should stay alert to the uh, infections that happen to the device. Sometimes I am noticing that my device is running out of battery very fast, or I can see high usage of the data consumption. This means that there is something wrong with the device. I should not ignore these signs of in the device. Avoiding using public Wi-Fi or when, while I'm dealing with my sensitive information. Take uh, into consideration this point. The, this functionality was uh, presented by Apple uh, years ago, but people are not aware about it. It limits some functionalities on the device once you enable it. You have to train yourself or a little bit teach yourself when you enable or activate this functionality as it will meet some functionalities. For example, it automatically blocks attachments on the SMS. And also regarding the browsing, it will also block some protocols, for example. If you are sharing some photos, it will remove the location details. So the lockdown mode is really a good and perfect feature that Apple provided, but people are not aware of.